quite a long time ago when we first started, um, one of my uncles, he came to see me and we were sort of talking about the mahi and he said to me, well, you know, Justin, um, the atamira was a, was a platform for the body uh, where all the layers used to come off and decay. And so you were left with the truth, the bones. That's kind of a spooky sort of space to kind of realise because it's almost like that's not what we meant. But then suddenly it carried this gigantic sort of responsibility for having integrity around the use of that word. We realised that we were ourselves, the bones of our ancestors, and that the stage was a place for that conduit of spirit to happen. Atamira brings me into different spaces in myself. Um, as a artist, as a dancer, as a mother, uh, but mostly as a spiritual being. Um, as tangata, it connects me to atua, um, it connects me to my tupuna. The combination of uh, a Māori understanding of tikanga practices, um, ideology, um, and a combination of a contemporary view on um, dance or contemporary dance, so kind of that fusion. Our individual stories are really unique, but then also I think there's a universal universality with all indigenous cultures around the world. It's really inspiring to um, gather information that we know or that already exists and then how to play with it within your own embodiment or your own physicality to find a new expression in a way that feels very ancient but also very new. When I work with Atamira, it's a time that we can work in a way that's really intuitive. We understand each other without having to explain a lot. Um, it's a time when we get to work on with our Māori tanga in our choreography and so for me it's a really special part of my life. It is a platform, but it's a platform not only for, for dance, it's for our whakapapa. What I do miss is that I, that was the one place where I managed to connect to, whether it was to the audience, um, to my whānau, but mostly it was to this other ethos, this whatever is out there, um, and that's where I felt the most powerful. But also, it's people, it's the wairua, it's the hininaro, it's the tīnana. And it helped me to find other ways of finding my own voice processes, other ways of working, uh, what I liked, why um, this worked and this didn't. Why, it's, why it really had resonance with me and so through that is able to give me a, help me to find my own voice and understand and sit um, in the space where I'm comfortable and knowing that this is me and this is how I want to present myself. What inspires me are the people who've been part of it right from the start, such as Jack Gray, Delina Wehi Peihana, Justine Hohaya, Marka Pepene, Moss Patterson, all the people, the whānau involved. I see myself working with all those experienced people that have been around for the last 20 years, who I have just met and gotten to be a part of. And then I see as the years go by, more people, more young dancers, collaborators coming in to make Atomeda even better than it is now and make new memories that people in the world can relate to. And feel the energy that he on stage with them. Atamita worked very much with this Tuakana Taina relationship um, and it's kind of works in circles as well so as the um, new ones come through the old ones always come back and um, that fold keeps on returning and the um, new grows with it so it's a circular um, cycle. So the thing is every time I see the dancers it's like I just saw them yesterday but I probably hadn't seen them for like five years or like yeah two years I could come back in the studio and everything could still be the same and it could be from one slight joke but I think that's also being Māori we we use we tend to always like um, feed off each other and feel each other's wairua and no matter what you do you cannot sever that try as you may and I have seen some people try um, I haven't tried to do that myself because I think well why would I it's part of who I am and I'm a part of who Atamira is. Um, we may go separate directions at d different times, but 
there's always this constant, right? there's always this toda pulling you along. Instantly you walk into the room with these people and you feel inspired to make things, be with those people, be around dancers that feel the same as you. Incredible to think that I'm part of that journey and that there'll be many more layers and um, people that will come through this company. I feel full of um, potential, I guess. And IT Meta provides a really great uh, space for exchange. Like I can really bring what I am to the process. And I'd love to just continue my exploration of and who I am culturally, but who, uh, who I am holistically.